Hey guys, it's Gabby. And today is Sunday, May 24th, I think. My school um, ended Thursday. Technically we ended Wednesday, but we ended Thursday. Um, so I thought it would be fun to do a what is in my backpack at the end of the school year. So I kind of put it back together the way it was when I had it in school. And then obviously I'm going to take stuff out of it, clean stuff out of it right now. Go. Okay, so this is my backpack. It's an Under Armour backpack. It's white and gray. And I like it. It has these padded straps and stuff. It's nice. So first we're going to start on the outside of my bag. So on this side, in the cup holder, is my Hydro Flask. Yes, I know. This good girl, whatever. Um, with my stickers on it. So let's see, we have an apple sticker, a sticker um, which represents like Galicia, the Galician region in Spain, um, a sticker from my school, a Wally sticker, if you can see that, Wally sticker, a spa sticker from my old dance school, a Winnie the Pooh and Tigger sticker, a Paris sticker, a smiley face sticker, a Pura Vida pineapple sticker and just a sticker that says party and then on top it has a little quoted sticker I don't know if you can read that it says something about like even in the darkest times light shines through something like that or other soap or something and then there's nothing in this pocket and then on this cup holder right here I keep my earbuds because if you know me, I'm always listening to music, and I love music, it's everything to me. Um, so I go to school, I'm listening to music, I leave school, I'm listening to music. Sometimes in school, I'm listening to music. So I have my earbuds at the ready. Sorry, that's my desk. Then I have a hand sanitizer, because, you know, I can never go wrong with hand sanitizer. And I think I have more than one, but I'm not entirely sure. But this is the Bath and Body Works Pure Paradise, if you can see that with the focus that'd be great yeah so that's the pure paradise and then I have two chapsticks I think and they're the same and I love them they're the Blistex soft and lush lip protected plus sunscreen so FPF 15 it's a really nice one it smells really good it's probably yeah I like it it smells so good it's like a very good vanilla. So nice. I used to only have one in there and then I thought I lost it, so I think I put another one in there. Um then I have one of my friendship bracelets for some reason that I got in Mexico. It's really pretty, it's just a blue let's see. It's a blue and pink one. I like it a lot. I wear it a lot in summer, which is now, so I shall probably should wear it. Then I don't know why, but I have a broken bouncy ball in here. I had a bouncy ball from something. I think my brother gave it to me. And then I broke it. Because I was really stressed out. Um, okay. Garbage. Let's see, that's part of the reason I'm doing this. Oh! Um, then I have... Two cough drops, apparently. Luden's cough drops, Jerry's cough drops, are everything. Okay. <laughs> Garbage. Oh, and a bobby pin because you can never go wrong with a bobby, a bobby pin. And some change. 11 cents. So that's fun. We're going to leave that there. So yeah. Oh, and on the front of my backpack, there is a Mamma Mia pin from the show I was in this year. And I love that. So that's really fun. So yeah, that's the outside of my backpack. Go to the front pocket right here. Um, with the little Under Armour sticker, so like right here. Actually, we're gonna do the one with my button on it because it's smaller. So in here is usually I, where I put all my pens and pencils or things that I reach for on a daily basis, like all the time, every period, stuff like that. So, I'm a fan in here, I don't know why. It's one of those ones that you plug into your phone and then it'll spin. Yeah, I don't know why. I think it's broke too. Okay, then I have 
pens and pencils that I reach for all the time. So I have just two normal mechanical pencils, a pen from um, Illinois State College of Fine Arts, and then one from the hotel I stayed in in Mexico. So that's fun. <laughs> um, then I have an eraser. Um, it says hashtag gone, so you never know when you need an eraser and your pencils don't have an eraser on them anymore. And then, my friend saw my Wally sticker on my um, water bottle, and then he wrote Eva on my eraser. I don't know if you guys see that. Let's see. You probably can't, but he wrote Eva on my eraser, so. Um, Then I have some sticky notes with guitar chords on it for some reason, but I'll put that with my guitar stuff. Okay. Then next I have my eyeglass clear cloth thing. But I don't actually reach for a whole lot, but I should. Um, and I have this... Okay, it sticks on your phone, like this, and then you push it, and it's like a slap bracelet so it curls up. So you can hold it better or something, I don't know. I think I got it for a spirit day. Um, then I have an eraser top. Um, oh, okay. So I have this little rock, okay? It's a little heart. Um, I have a couple of these, but my mom always gets them for me um, as like a symbol of like, I love you, I miss you kind of a thing. Um, so yeah, I keep that in there. It's class too. Um, I also have this, I also keep this mask card in my backpack. Um, on the back it says footprints in the sand. It's really pretty. Um, it's my grandpa's, so if you don't know, I if you've ever seen me with my heart necklace on, with the gold heart, um, with the silver and the flower in the middle, that was for my grandpa. Um, and that's why I wear that every day. I miss him and love him so so much. And so yeah, I keep this with me every day too. And the last thing in this pocket which isn't always in this pocket, obviously, um, which I just put in there now, but I have there during school, is my phone. Um, yeah. Ooh, we have a few notifications, but yeah, so I keep my phone in there, because I always reach into here for stuff, so. Now we're going to go on to the front pocket right here. I have a lot of stuff in here, so if you bear with me, okay? Okay, so the first thing I have in here are my keys. <laughs> um, because obviously I reach for it all the time, and the pocket right here isn't big enough for them. So I have my keys and my lanyard and my ID and I have this Vera Bradley Disney um, wallet. So like right here, it has a little Mickey right there, so yeah. And then I have just a White Sox lanyard on it. Um, I keep the lanyard that came with the wallet on something else on my little wallet I got from Spain just so I can have two. Um, and like the socks one doesn't go with that, so I just put that on there. Then, okay, ready? This is my emergency survival kit. So, I got this free makeup bag from Ulta when I got something, I don't really know what. Uh, it's missing a zipper too, so that's really awkward. So, hold on. So, it's just a pink pearly bag. It says L'Oreal on it. So, it's just everything I think I need in case, like for any incident that could happen, okay? So, first I have some tissues because I have allergies, seasonal allergies, and you never know when you're gonna need some tissues. Then, I have Advil. You never know when you're gonna need Advil. Um, I have something called patella femoral pain syndrome in my knees, um, so sometimes my knees get upset, or sometimes, obviously, cramps and things like that. So I have Advil. Next, I have the matching body spray to my other hand sanitizer. Pure Paradise from uh, Bath and Body Works. It smells really good. I don't use it a whole lot, but I've had it for a while, so that's why it's half empty. You know, you never know when you're gonna smell gross. Like, I borrowed my friend's sweatshirt once, and I got all sweaty, because I used it in June. So I sprayed it. <laughs> Next, I have a mini tight stick, because you never know when you get a spill. So I got this new outfit last year. And I didn't have this yet. I didn't have this idea to carry this around with me. The, like the whole kit. And I had a coffee and my coffee was spilling for some reason. It just kept dripping on me. Um, so now that's why I have this. Next, I have another um, hand sanitizer. It's Slay from Bath and Body Works. 
smells really good. I like it. Then next, like I said, I have seasonal allergies. So we have a Claritin because yeah, allergies can be really bad sometimes. Next, I'm pulling out, it's called Arnicare, Arnica Gel. If you don't know what this is, um, it's to help with um, like muscle soreness and muscle tightness and swelling and things like that, or bruises. Um, so I have actually a bone bruise on my shin, my right shin, from a softball game a couple, about a year and a half ago. Yeah, about a year ago. Um, the girl slid right into my shin, so I have a bone bruise from that. I've actually had a number of bone bruises, or I use it on my knees and stuff like that just to help them cool down a little bit and like not hurt. Okay, then I have Pepto Bismol because you never know when your stomach's gonna be upset. So yeah, that's my reason. Um, then I have this Andental. It's basically Mexican aftertaste. Smells good, I think. Um, I got it in Mexico because I got a lot of bug bites and it's tiny so I carry it around with me. Then I have two different kinds of lotion. They're both Disney so that's funny. Um, one the Aquatics H2O lotion. It smells really good but it's really hard to get out of this thing. Like it just doesn't want to come out. Um, and then I have the White Tea Aloe Body Lotion from my favorite Disney hotel in the entire world. I've mentioned it in a different video. I love this one in Dolphin. It's everything. Smells amazing. Oh, it's so good. Then, I have a caramel candy, just in case. I have an emergency of something. Same reason I have this little grape candy. And then, all on the bottom are cough drops. Because at one time, I had a really bad cold, and I literally carried just a whole bag of cough drops, and I didn't even need that many. So, yeah. So that's why I always carry everything you could possibly need because of like purposes like this where like you just never know what scenario is gonna happen you know so that's why I carry all of this in here next in here like I said I have patella femoral pain syndrome so basically what that means is my patella my knee doesn't like go into my knee like it rubs against my knee so I had a knee strap for my knee to go under it so it supports it and like makes it easier to look and doesn't hurt and things like that. I also have another knee brace or an elbow brace depending on what I want to use it for. Um, I don't use it a whole lot but just in case you know. Then your favorite of mine, the hairbrush because you never know when you need to brush your hair or your hair looks really bad or something like that after gym or for gym. So I keep a hairbrush in here. Um, garbage. Ah, okay. Next, I know this looks really gross, I'm sorry. They have a mini lint roller in here. I... Okay, so the reason I keep this in here is because I have currently, up until about a month ago, I have had cats and there's they shed everywhere. Everywhere. I have a lot of black clothes, so that's why we have this. Um, next I have this strap they made me get because I had a blended class and I don't know why they made me get a red strap and I don't even use that. So um, I'll see if Matt wants it or something. Else. Then I have my very disconfigured and apparently wide open for some reason pencil case with like barely anything in it because I've taken everything out. Um, there used to be my scissors in here but now they're on my desk because I use them more often. And I just have the pens that I use at school. It's a lot of colorful pens and other pens and stuff that I like to use and extra pencils and stuff which I probably should put more of in here but I will later when school starts again. Oh and it also has a secret compartment so I like to put an extra eraser up here. So yeah. Then I have another patella strap because I have a little bit I have it in both my knees actually. So I have another one. And then like I said before I have an extra knee brace in case Anyone? Yeah, just in case. I need something else or with a low or something like that. Then apparently I have more tissues. Oh! And here's the zipper. Now we're gonna head to this pocket right here where I start keeping my school stuff. Okay, 
So first what you have is there's two pockets back here. And this side I keep a thing of sticky notes just in case. And then I have little like sticky note bookmark type things. You know, just in case I ever need to bookmark anything in my book so we can't write in. <laughs> okay, so I wrote down a couple of my quotes that one of my English teacher said this year. I wish more people wore gold hats. I will set you free, my little birds. It just dripped in my mouth. Why was my mouth open? <laughs> um, that's a funny story, actually, the last one. Um, she has this big window and it was, she was like looking she was walking around our room lecturing us about who knows what and she looked at the window and was like why, why is the window all wet and she looked up and I guess she like went like this it's sometimes you do when you look up and the water from the window dripped in her mouth and it was really funny okay then on the other side I have my calculator my TI 84 something graphing calculator your friend and mine oh yeah by the way, if anyone knows how to get games on their calculator, please let me know because I don't know how to do that. My ex had games and I always meant to ask him and I never did, so if you can help me, please let me know. Comment down below. And in the front of this, I have my planner, which I should use more, but I don't. It's a really pretty, like, pearly one with this cool pattern. And then I have a pure heat up tree. And then it's the same in the back. It has, like, little slits right here. So you can put stuff in there. I have the same on the back. Um, so I have a couple of my stuff in here. Get my instrument and then just hook. I did not use this very much. I think I stopped using it in late December. Oops. So yeah, we don't need this anymore so I can take this stuff out of it. But yeah, very handy. I really should have used it more. I did not. If you're in high school, I have a lot of things, a lot of extracurriculars, a lot of schoolwork, stuff like that. Um, I highly recommend you get a planner, um, because I was in four extracurriculars this year, I think, which isn't even that much for me. It's in my most. I think the most I've been in at one time is six, but yeah, I highly recommend you get one. Okay, then my schedule as a junior, I have just graduated being a junior. I'm a senior now, or about to be a senior. So I took a gym, you have to take a gym, obviously. But second semester this year, I took um, junior PE leader, which means like it's a warm up to be a senior PE leader, which basically means um, help run the freshman and sophomore classes, which you've already taken. Um, and I think they're really fun. It was so much fun. Um, and then the other, I took normal gym, and then you choose what you kind of want to do after that. Um, then I took Spanish four, so I'm going to be in Spanish five this year. Um, what else? Physics. Obviously, I took a lunch. Honors English 3, Lucky for 2, Intro to Teaching um, 1, and Advanced Band. So, obviously, I needed all kinds of folders and stuff for that. So, first, I have this um, notebook for physics, um, with just obviously like some lab notes and things in here. So I don't need this thing, which I don't even know why they give us these, because look, out of the whole notebook, we didn't use most of it. I don't know why. Um, okay, then I have my English folder, and I started taking AP Psych. Don't recommend, I don't recommend it. Um, yes, I did find it interesting, but it was extremely hard for me personally. So that's my AP Psych stuff, and then this is all my honest English stuff. And then at the bottom of the page, so I was a link leader this year. If you don't know what that is, it's during your lunch period for the first half, you and about three or four others, um, juniors, kind of teach freshmen what's going on in the school, how things work, what to do, what there is to do, how to do things, stuff like that. Um, and their way around, to teach them their way around school. So from my freshman year, and this year, so at the end of the, at the last class, you do what you like most. Link is called Link Love, and what you do is write down what you like about certain people, and then you put on this little sticker, and then you stick it on them. Um, you can do it about the leaders, you can do it about the other kids in the class, you can do it about the teacher that you have, um, or anything you want like that. So on the bottom of my page here, I have all my 
Blink Love from Fresh Mirror and this year. And they're so cute. I love them so much. Blink was one of the best things I ever decided to do. It was so much fun. Um, highly recommend it if you do, if you live in my area. Um, so I highly recommend it. It's so much fun. Then this folder is my physics folder. And she'd give you a sticker at the end of the week. High Five Friday. So I have a lot of stickers down there. Okay, and then the last thing, sorry, I just put my bag down. I have is my five subject notebook, which I highly, highly recommend you get. Um, because you take eight main subjects, um, and you need a notebook for about all of them. That's why if you have a science, like if you have a science, they usually give you one. But otherwise you have like you need a notebook. So in the front where I did some of my e-learning stuff, and then I love that it's sectioned off because I just don't like carrying so many notebooks and the point of having to put them away and do all kinds of stuff. So I have my Spanish section that we didn't use a whole lot of, my English section which we didn't use a whole lot of, my AP Psych section which we used a lot of, um, my intro to teaching and my like, they have little folders there. So this is the stuff from the classes I observed, so that was nice, and the stuff we talked about. But yeah, so I highly recommend you get one of these because it just saves you so much time and like weight of all the extra notebooks that could be bigger than that each. Like not they couldn't all each, but together for about five subjects, there's not enough. Like it'd just be too heavy for you, which I think. And I'm a small person, so yeah. That's the that pocket. Okay, so we're gonna get this one. And then we have our last pocket. Okay, so first of all, I have my computer with my cord because my phone always dies because I use my phone a lot. So I have my computer and my phone charger. So that's nice. Then, ooh. Apparently I have this book which I need to return. Whoopsie. I'll return it when I get the book. Whoops. Um, then I have this honors English second semester readings that we read everything in. Kind of intense, but yeah. Then I have my Spanish binder. I love it. I put this paper, scrap paper in here. And it's neon orange and it's getting kind of old now. I've had it for five years now. Four I'm a junior, so it's four years because I used this in eighth grade. Um, but basically it's sectioned off into stuff we've done. So these are some notes for my friends. Um, just a hole puncher in case they don't give you things hole punched because they usually don't. And the first part is usually stuff for like ancient seats and stuff. It's just sectioned off very nicely. And my last section is everything from the rest of my Spanish classes and for like references and things like that in case I don't have any or I don't know what I'm talking about. And then the very last thing in my backpack is my take home folder and it's everything that I need to take home or interest in. So the left side is usually things that I'm keeping, so it's my music and things like that and the right side is all my homework. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry I rushed through that last part, but my camera is going to die. So if you made it this far, thanks so much for watching. Um, Click the subscribe button down below, give this video a big thumbs up, and comment down below what other videos I should do and who I should do them with after quarantine. Um, so yeah, thanks guys for watching, and stay safe, stay healthy, and yeah. I'll probably do one of these again, like, before school, just to go through some stuff, stuff like that. But yeah, so, bye guys. I like me better when I